Yeah. Ready? Totally. Open him, open him, open him. Open him. <gasps> Stupidas. Good morning. My tiradero in the back is me. You guys, today is my quinceañera. So, como ya saben, my birthday already passed. It was Wednesday, August 18. Pero today is Saturday. I had to sneeze. And I couldn't get it out. Anyways, today is Saturday and I am throwing up my party. I'm so nervous, but okay, let me see. Let me bring it down a few notches and get it real with you guys. Let me see. Oh, wait, no, you're gonna see my this madre. So, I am throwing a little party for my birthday. I am turning 22. For all of you who were like, oh my god, are you barely turning 15? What the fuck? I thought you were like 30. I thought you were 27. Which, first of all, F you, I'm 22. A lot of people actually thought that I was turning 15 because I'm a quinceañera. I'm like, stupid. Usa la cabecita. But anyways, yes, I am turning 22 and I'm having a little party today. And I've never thrown a party in my life. Like, for friends. I've thrown little parties back at home. But if you've been here on my channel, you've heard, you've heard me. Me. Oh, I can't speak Spanish or English. Me dumb. Sorry, I'm pretty, not smart. Anyways, if you've been on my channel for a long time, you've heard me talk about this before, saying that I never really had friends growing up. So I've always been like very, very lonely. I've always had like a very small group of friends all throughout like elementary school, middle school, and high school. I'm telling you guys, my hometown for the most part was a very, very, very toxic place for me growing up, a lot of my chistas. And not only that, but when I started doing social media when I was 15, which means I was like a freshman in high school, I did get a lot of shit for it because it wasn't as big as it is now where like literally everyone is on social media, like TikTok, Instagram, YouTube. Like back then, I kid you not, I swear, I felt like I was the only one in my hometown doing it. And I was just like always getting bullied to be like, oh my God, why don't you put yourself out there? Like, oh my God, he thinks he's this, he thinks he's down, like what the fuck, like just a lot of really negativity. You guys know the story if you've been here for a minute. I've talked about it lots of times before. But as much as I've always wanted to throw parties, like I never really had people show up. The first time that I did throw a little party, um, it was literally just like my family, my hermanas, and I want to say like five of my friends. And just knowing that I had those people who really do love and support me made that day so happy. Like I used to think like I can't throw a party because no one, not a lot of people would show up, which means I'm not gonna have fun. But like, if that stupid does, if you're feeling the same way that I felt where I was like, I can't throw a party because not a lot of people would show up. As long as your real ones show up and you have your family there, you're good. Like those little parties were like the most fun I've ever had. Like I had so much fun during those parties and my friends, that's why I love them so much. And they always bring out the best in me and they always make me laugh and happy. So I had such an amazing time throwing those little parties, but I've always wanted to throw like a bigger party, but I never really had the friends to do that. So for my 22nd birthday, I was like, you know what? I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna invest a lot of money into this party and I'm gonna have my whole quinceanera fantasy. I can't even talk right now. Like I really just wanted to live that moment and I just sent out the invitation to um, some of my friends and I'm still really nervous right now. I don't know if a lot of people are gonna show up, if not that many people are gonna show up, but my mentality right now is like, whoever shows up is gonna mean a lot to me. Like the fact that they're taking time out of their day to celebrate with me and just be there for me. Like, I don't care how many people show up. Anyone who's there, I just know I'm gonna have fun. I know I have my family here and I do have a lot of my close friends who like flew in from like their hometowns, which is really far from here. Cause obviously I'm not from here. But yeah, I have no idea what to expect. I'm just trying not to get anxious or nervous and just feel all like, <laughs> That's not what I want. So I did wake up really late today because I haven't been sleeping well. So it is like 3 p.m. Yeah, it's 3 p.m. and I should have been getting ready ready, but tengo tantos nervios just because I don't know what to expect. Um, even the venue, I have no idea what it looks like. I hired a party planner, shout out to you. They are taking care of everything for me. I kind of just gave them my vision. I told them I want purple, I want perra land, I want quinceanera vibes. Like, I just threw so many things at them and 
I have no idea what it looks like. So I have seen no pictures. I know what the venue looks like. It's an outdoor venue. But as for decorations, I have no idea what it looks like and I don't even know what to expect. So there's a lot of things in my head right now that are like <laughs> causing me to go crazy. I still haven't gotten ready. I have no idea what the place looks like. I have no idea who's going. <sighs> but I'm just trying to keep calm and I'm just gonna have fun. That's all I know. No matter what happens, I'm gonna have fun and I'm so freaking excited. So I'm gonna go get ready because I should have been ready a long time ago. I have to head out. I wanted to head out like in an hour, but that's not gonna happen. So let me just shut the fuck up and let me go get ready. Y ahorita regreso. <sighs> She's ready again with my tita little in the back. Okay, you guys, so ya estoy lista. I got my maquillaje done by the one and only me. Here is a little close up of the eyeshadow, very similar to what I did for my quinceanera video. Here we have the custom fit. My Crocs are me. <laughs> I got a little purple jacket on with rhinestones, some more rhinestones under the little pants. Atrás, they say my initials on my bumpies. LC. <laughs> You'll get a better view of it once we're at the party. Pero como siempre, I am running late, so I'm about to head out. It's about like a 45, 50 minute drive from me right now. Porque hay pinche tráfico, so I need to hurry up. But I'm so freaking excited to see it. The party planner, Luis, just texted me being like, you're gonna absolutely love how it turned out. We did everything that you wanted us to do. So, <sighs> I'm so excited. So I'm about to head over. I can't wait to see my friends and party. Like I said, no matter what, I just want to have fun. And I hope that everyone else who shows up has a great time también. All right, but let me just shut the fuck up. And let's go to my quince. <laughs> All right, you guys, so we are on our way there. I am actually staying in a little hotel super close to it, but we are about 14 minutes away, and I'm getting more and more and more and more and more nervous as we get there. <sighs> I'm trying to stay calm, but I am really, really, really nervous and anxious. Miren, amigas, when I tell y'all it's in the middle of nowhere, I really mean in the middle of nowhere. So we better not be getting no noise complaints, porque yo si quiero bailar toda la noche. I don't think anyone's gonna be there. I put on my invitation that the party starts at five, but I only put five because I know we be showing up late as fuck. So I was like, I feel like people will start showing up like around seven. So it's barely 6.30 and I'm showing up. I'm trying to get like some pictures and stuff beforehand. Really don't think anyone's gonna be there, but if they are, well, I'm pissed out. Bye, amigas. <gasps> We're here, holy fuck, I don't wanna see. Um, no, just keep going. Keep going, go this way though, for that car, and just keep going straight, I don't wanna look. <sighs> My heart's beating so fast, I feel like they're gonna fucking, fucking pass out. Oh shit, those real elephants. Oh shit, dude, I thought those were real <laughs> elephants. <laughs> I was like, I don't know, we got elephants. <laughs> dude, <Surprise>. I swear. <laughs> and I'm like, yeah, it's right on. <laughs> All right, stupid ass, let's get it. Here, here, here. You guys tell me when, oh, or where do I stand so I can open up? Uh, Walk a little more. More? This way? Have it. Straight? Yeah. Ready? Tell me open him, open him, open him. Open him.
Jesus! Okay, I just want to say thank you so much to every single one of you who came to my party. Hey, hey. Oh my god, you guys! What the fuck? Did you see that already? I'm ready, let's go. Oh my god, the bowl! Ooh, girl, y'all want to kiss me? Hi, bro! Hi! Oh, Every queen. Girl, stop! <laughs> what the hell? Hey, I'm gonna go first, baby. I don't even want to walk out here. Wow! And I'm going to go for the drive. Se me hizo quisiera tocar, ándate no seas malita, yo quiero una tocadita, ahí, ahí, ahí. Qué lindo es tu cuerpo, bonito tu cuerpo, rey de mi corazón. Look at the donut. What the hell? Mi mano no pasa. Wow. Otra noche, otra. Ay que yo no te bote. Otra, otra noche, otra. Que tú vuelvas con él. Look, you guys, they're wearing my aprons. How fucking cute. So, there's a whole little taco truck. I got some birria. Look at the menu. Pa' que se les antoje. Bum. Yo le voy a entrar a la comida right now before I get drunk. Because, look, we have a lot of these waiting for me. We got the shots. Thank you. Cheers! Cheers. Oh, 
How many more? Just for me. Cheers! How was it? How was it? How was it? No, no, no. How was it? How was it? That's water right there. Uh, how was it? How was it? How was it? How was it? It was uh, sensational. <laughs> Laura, you can't relate, can you? I can't relate, my ass flat. I know you want to see my hole. <laughs> you can't see me. Bitch. It's under there. But I'm scared that it's going to go more and more. Let me see my fingers. Ah. Oh, yeah. Come on, come on. How? That's too fat. Oh, okay. What's up?
Oh, but she called when she flew on the town. She told me she would never fuck with me. Look at her now. Got the number for me.
Lupitas. Okay, I just want to say thank you so much to every single one of you who came to my party. Honestly, I've never thrown a party before, so I was really nervous that no one was going to show up. So the fact that you guys took the time out of your day to be here means the absolute world to me. Thank you so much. Like, I've never been happier in my life. You guys are making my 22nd, aka quinceañera, the best time ever. Drunk as fuck, and I don't even know what I'm saying. <laughs> if you guys aren't drunk, y'all need more shots. Yeah. Well, I love you guys so much. Thank you for taking the time to even be here and celebrating with me. Oh, Let me fun. do it in 2020. Uh, Wait. I don't even know. All I know is that it's the perras here, period. Yeah. Thank you guys so much for being here. I love you so much. Every single one of you who is here right now celebrating with me. I hope you guys are having fun. Take more shots and we're here to have a little perra moment. No sé y no tengo ni idea cómo ingaos estoy despierto right now, but day two. Uh, con todo el desmadre en mi casa. Dirty as fuck. But let me show you guys real quick. We have this uh, drawing that Laudi made for me, a little brats moment. A bunch of my amigos were trying to get me fucked up. Look at all these Don Julio bottles. Oh my God, I love y'all. And then we have some clase azul, little thing. And then ignore the cochinero. We have some more bottles that I got for my birthday. And then we have some more right here. My mom was being a mom and stealing all the recuerdos. Look at all this. So we have some Tapatio bottles with me on them. Dude, like literally stole boxes. Hasta las pinches paletas se trajo. And then we have like some more of like the, the little invitations. Well, not invitations, but they were like on the table. Some hot Cheetos. She even brought the. I was like, oh my god, I don't the even know menu. all of these were the. The menu too. Hold on. Bless you. Look, también estos antojitos. Let me see the menu. Look, the menu was sick though. Like, I love me. So we had glam cheering to los 15 años de la más perra. Period. The menu, we had the baddest perra, which is the blueberry mojito. We had the stupida, which was the Jamaica paloma. 
We had La Quinceañera, which was a berry berry margarita. And then Carla, which was a cranberry peach vodka. They should have had a mahi mahi, but just one mahi because we're not that hungry. That would have been cute. But yeah, the menu was so fucking cute. Some more. I think my favorite part of the party was that it was all about me. <laughs> Alia. But we are about to head out because the party nunca para. We are gonna go to a little after party moment at Bree's house. She's having a little pool party with like tacos, and I think she's gonna have like live music. I don't fucking know. All I know is that I'm ready, and let's go. We're here at her palace. You guys, I'll never get over how beautiful her house is. Like goals as a fuck. We're here. Vienen entradas en la alberquita. <laughs> oh, that looks so good right now. Yes, Marquez. <laughs> We're still celebrating Lily's birthday. Yes. She said, party at my house. Yeah, party at my house yes. For Can you fall for the vlog? No, why am I going to get up here? I don't know. No, Tú brincale, brincale. Okay. Sin vergüenza. Do a backflip. Do a backflip. <laughs> go jump, go jump, go jump. I'm going. Louis, come right here. Like, yeah, how are you doing it? Go, go, go. Oh, it's cold out here. I am. <laughs> Yo, I'm freezing. Oh my god, you're right, it's cold. <laughs> here being boring, just drinking, not doing shit. you guys that's a wrap al fin el perreo is done tomorrow is monday so tenemos que regresar a la chinga <sighs> boring i don't want to be a bitch but you're really boring <laughs> where's makeup all right have a good night stupid ass thank you guys so much for watching love you <laughs> adios subscribe